want to look professional when you're just starting your career? Need to build that work wardrobe knowing what essentials to buy? Invest in core wardrobe pieces that you can rewear and style in new ways to build multitude of outfits. Blazers are essential to have to layer over your blouses, dresses, jumpsuits, and more. Invest in at least three core blazers that you can style with various outfits. First, you want a stylish black blazer, one that has an interesting design detail, so it might look like great sleeves, an interesting buttons, some draping on it, some kind of features that stand out and make it eye-catching. You can also easily change the buttons on any blazer by simply going to a fabric store, choosing some more ornate, beautiful design, and having those re-sewn or sewing them yourself on your blazer. Next, second, you want to get a bold color blazer or jacket. Think blacks, greens, and reds that tie in with most of the, your work wardrobe. You want to avoid overly bright colors, such as Barbie pinks and purples, which tend to look more kid-like and fun and aren't office appropriate. Third, you want to get a neutral blazer. Think olive colored, camels, white, off-white, navy. All should have a great fit and style that you can rewear. What you want to avoid is getting into too specific of things that don't go well and aren't universal to wear. So cropped blazers, for example, or boyfriend blazers, which are a bigger style, look great, but really don't go well with everything in your office wardrobe. So think about purchasing waist or hip length blazers that really give you the most versatility. Sheep dresses are universally appropriate style for the office. Fitted dresses, sun dresses, or dresses you would generally wear to a club or bar are not office appropriate. So instead, you want to choose two solid color dresses and two print dresses that will work well for your work wardrobe. You can wear these by themselves, simply with jewelry and high heels, and then restyle each of these four dresses with a cardigan, a boyfriend blazer, tuxedo style blazer, whatever type of layering piece that you also purchase and have. Kind of gives it that versatility and looks. And all of these are pieces that you can wear as well for work and weekends or to weekends and evenings out. You want to avoid anything too tight or overly fitted in a pencil skirt pencil skirt really should give a polished, put-together look for the office. Start with a neutral pencil skirt that you can wear and pair that with print blouses or solid color pieces. That could be in black, gray, navy, or any color that truly works as a backdrop for the other pieces you have, such as your blazers, blouses, and accessories. Next, you want to choose a bold color pencil skirt. That will look great and truly pop, paired with other solid color blouses in dark neutrals, or you can pair that with bold prints and other blazers. Then choose a pencil skirt that's in a bolder print style. Think of neutral print color combinations to truly stand out. So that could be a black and white print, like a leopard print, zebra print, something in that realm a navy and white, or a gray and white print. That should compare with your different blouses you have and blazers to truly give you universal looks. Your blouses, tops, sweaters, and knits, you can find a great selection without having to spend a lot. A couple of great options for you to look for in blouses and tops. Look for a striped blouse option going with a bigger, bolder, thicker vertical stripe. Truly a great style to wear universally. Also add a colorful print blouse. Always pops and stands out. Look for a bold, solid color, and then also get a neutral that's a perfect top to layer with other pieces. Nothing looks worse than wearing cheap, bad shoes. Invest 
in two good pairs of high heels. First, a skin tone color, which elongates your leg, and it can be worn with any outfit type to the office. Always a great neutral that you can wear again and again. Also, add a black, gray, or some type of darker color that you can wear with your pants, your pencil skirts, that are all in that same color tone or color family. Kind of gives you that head-to-toe universal look. These will be your power shoes. As you have more wardrobe, budget, and time to shop, you can add other stylish options such as chunky high heels, mules, and loafers. In terms of jewelry, you want to stick to neutral metallic pieces that really give you that universality that you can wear with everything. Nothing too bold or avant-garde for the office. We hope these tips help you shop smart, for what to wear to the office and buy when you're starting your career. Comment below with your fashion questions and we'll be happy to answer them and help. Share with your thoughts on what you bought for the office or your favorite pieces of workwear as you build that wardrobe. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button below to get our weekly videos like this one. Scroll down to get the style freebies and watch the rest of this professional pizzazz style series. See you on the next video.